Yes, 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 we live, we live. I know we're supposed to get started at 6 o'clock, but fuck it. If we ready, we ready now. Got a special guest coming up. Uh, Mount Rushmore caliber. Uh, I don't even, I think saying the top 10 battler is an understatement at this point. Um, definitely a legend. One of the faces of the Midwest. One of the creators of the Midwest movement. Honored to have my guy here. He gave me hell in the beginning of my career, but it helped shape me to, to where I am today. I got to give him credit for that. Yeah. Niggas still be giving me hell. But still to this day. To this day. Um, but you know, we gonna get my guy in here. A verb. What's the word? Hello, everyone. How are you? I'm chilling, man. Uh, uh, kind of think about it. I think you always gonna be like a rookie. Like I, I you never like gonna be like no man and shit. But you like a a good. Like come on, man. We we starting early with yeah. this shit. We come on, man. I don't. I don't. I don't. I'm I'm, I'm 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 a I'm a couple million views in now. I'm I'm some uh some headlines hey, in now. You know I what? You can't you can't. You know you know what we, you know what we might have to respect you a little differently now. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. It's a little you different. Made you made it to the party, big dog. <laughs> Welcome here. That's a fact. Now, verb salute though. I appreciate you taking the time. Fuck with me, all of the above and the fans. They were yeah. definitely excited. Like, hold on, this nigga got verb on this shit. I know this shit about yeah, to be I, crazy. I, 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 I don't really do this type of shit, you know. That's um, a fact. Yeah, it's not really my thing. But that's you know, a fact. Yeah. So, um, what I want to start off with is the music. Yeah. The music is fire, and it's not like you don't you don't sound like a battle rapper trying to make music. There's a difference. You don't sound like a battle rapper trying to make music. No. You actually sound like. Um, when you battle like an artist that battles versus a battle rapper trying to make music. You agree with that? How you feel about that statement? Uh, see, what people don't know is that was my first thing was the studio, the music. That mm. was my, my first thing. I was I was turning up on the mixtape scene, but I could, I could also... By me being a British, and I used to watch and all that shit iniquity. So, mm. you know, that was how my everything started. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I, I got popular on the mixtape scene first. You know what I'm saying? So And this is before you went to this going. is before Word War, this is before all of that? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I was six mixtapes in in my region before like before Word you know, Word War and all that. Yeah. Mm. Cause I remember watching them early uh St. Louis battles before uh niggas made it to smack. I remember watching, you know, you and Hollow, even before you actually battle Hollow, because I remember watching them, uh, the battles, and you was hosting them shits. You was hosting them. You had the waves in, and I'm like, yo. Well, they was, well, 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 World War was my event. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That, and what I did was, um, I had brought in, uh, Street Status DVD, mm. and, uh, my, also my partner Marcus was Street Report, but that was event I created, you know what I'm saying? And, mm. it, was, and it was because of a, a respect for me as far as being an MC and being like, you know, one of the most, you know, popular guys, you know, that's why I stayed packed and shit. So it was a respect mm. and it was a, a, a talent thing. So you, so when you started putting these battles together, you haven't battled yet. It was straight music and you just wanted to put some battles together. Like, how no, did no, that no, come no, about? No, no, no. No, I, I I had the time to. I was more focused on the music at that time, but I had already did mm. like battles and tournaments, and all, they knew me from that too. So you know what I'm saying. So mm. I, it was like a hybrid, mm. thing, you know. So there was there was underground battles and yeah, shit going and, on. And um, more more of the Fight Club style, like not necessarily Fight Club, like when the beat will come on and mm. you know that kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I forget what we you know what that style is called, but that was. That was in every place, you know, pretty much. And you definitely yeah. got to be on an island somewhere because that Wi Fi. Yeah, you was. Sometimes you got crack, so crack something. So, 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 because it, it was, it was crazy. Well, um, you human motherfucker shouldn't have Wi Fi. <laughs> yeah, nah. It, it was, it was crazy. It was crazy watching those shits though. Um, 
it was crazy watching those because you know what St. Louis is known for. You know, at that time it was Nelly and at, when I was a battle rap fan, I'm watching like, nah, niggas really out there got bars. And I think at that time, St. Louis was one of the states that took battle rap way more serious than a lot of other places. That's a fact. Well, we had more to prove, though. Yeah, we had more to prove because we already had a tag on us that we went shit like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So we had, we always came in with a chip on our shoulders and shit, though, because it's like, the game was, was not tailored for us, so we had to fight a little harder than everybody else. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I remember it was, uh, it was a lot of y'all. It was you, of course, Hitman, Young L, Juice Zilla, Remy. Um, who who else was the early, those, that was basically it? Like the early, I guess, faces of St. Louis Battle Rap? Or there's more that just didn't make the threshold? You still, uh, let me see, uh, Bird Hitman? Burger Man, Ice Pack, Juice Zilla, yep. Benny, Blaze Up, G Soldier, G Soldier, Spotlight, mm. Spotlight, D Mac, Julie, B Mac, heard of B Mac, like a few more, you know. Yeah. Uh, 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 you said Mac, Magic or Mac? You said B Mac, right? You talking about you talking about back then? Yeah. No, D Mac, D with a D. D is a, oh, D Mac, D Mac. The dog. Hmm. But magic yeah, yeah, wasn't yeah, magic yeah, wasn't yeah, around I, I back then. About, uh, uh, B Mac. Nah. Uh, no, I, I I didn't remember him from. I'm not saying he wasn't around. I didn't know him back then. Yeah. So then, what happens next? Smack calls or like how how did that come about? How did first of all at that time there was no social media. So how the fuck was niggas reaching out to y'all? There was no social media. Nah, we had MySpace. We had MySpace sucking. We had MySpace. Oh. Okay, that's where it started. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we got our, our footage was getting uploaded to MySpace, and that's what kind of like kicked the shit off. Footage yeah. got uploaded to MySpace, and that's how everybody was getting their views. The same way Soldier Boy was getting them. So, mm -hmm. that was pretty much how that shit happened. Mm -hmm. But, but yeah, like the first call I had from URL was from Norbs, mm -hmm. and um, well, it, well, yeah, Norbs, and he wanted me to go on stage, and I'm like, nah. I just didn't want to. And that, you know, this guy was fun. Well, you just said no because you just ain't yeah. feel like it? Like, you just like, fuck that, I don't feel like it type shit? It's the same way as the feeling I mean. That's my, was a, I said no. I, I don't remember to this day. But I think he wanted me to take Cortez. I don't remember who it was, though. Mm. And um, I think I, I just said no. Because I was just coming out battling... Uh, Marv one in grind time. Mm. So would you? Oh, and I was just like, nah. Hold on. So you battled on grind time before you went to to smack because what there was no URL yet, right? Yeah. But that grind time shit was uh, after was, uh, you were SB though, right? Yeah, me and SB was on the street corner uh, uh, in New York City, February twenty eighth. Yeah. And then I took Hollow in July. I don't remember, you know, what the time was. July. Then I took after Hollow, I took Marv the next month, and then mm. I then I took Miles in St. Louis, and then I took Mav. That was my first five times. And that was in the same year. Uh, within within under a year time, like so it was like eleven months. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Nah, that's fire. So they reach out to you on MySpace. And, hold on. You said Norbs no, contacted Lux you. Did. Norbs yeah, did. Lux did. Lux did. Yeah, see, what, 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 you know what? Actually, there's another thing, too. I forgot. Um, after I did SB on the corner, Fight Club reached out to me, and they wanted me to run out there the next week, and I said, no. The so, next... Niggas is crazy. Like, they don't... <laughs> Sometimes don't, league owners hey, don't respect hey, hey, niggas' time, hey, man. Hey, listen. So I, I know it's a lot of fans watching or something like that. Mm -hmm. What y'all don't understand is, man, when we not on this shit, we have normal... Ain't nobody walking around thinking about this shit like that. <laughs> like, no. Nah. But it's, it's like, it's hard for them to process that thought. Like, no. Nah. Mm. Like, if I'm not, I'm not, I'm not watching battle rap unless I got to go on stage and I'm not thinking about that shit. Right. It, I go on stage. Not only the fans, though, the league owners, niggas that be trying to book shit within certain times. It's like, come on. Like, like, what do you think? Like, niggas just going to shut everything down right now and just focus on this other and nigga. And, and, yeah. And, and, and if the deposit ain't came, no. How, you know how hard that is? <laughs> Man. <laughs> yeah, but, but but people really just don't understand it, man. We take our shit off just like y'all do every take. 
Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I don't be nah, I'll be detached like a month on this shit. Having threesomes and making uh only fans videos and shit like that. Like I ain't <laughs> Nah, you don't got no only fans. You don't got no only fans. You don't got only <laughs> Oh, he said, uh, the, the audio, what's up with the audio? Y'all can hear me good? Y'all can hear Verb? Can hear me? Let me know. Can y'all hear me? Let me know. Somebody said free Verb Twitter. You got hacked? Nah, actually, I'm glad someone brought that up. So Twitter just decided to block me, right? Mm-hmm. And and I'm like, damn, for what? And they emailed me, and it was a, a, a something I said to my Verb, so I don't know. If- oh, my God, something <laughs> crazy. I don't know. But I, I, I lost my page though. I have to email them on Instagram, so I ain't on Twitter. They just told me no, nah, and I'm and then I I'm in them back like, hey, what the fuck? This ain't even half the shit I done said. I didn't accept this shit though, so I don't know what they're gonna do with Twitter. They got like, sensitive. I don't know how you gonna survive. Nah, some somebody somebody uh snitched on me. That's all it was. Yeah, nah. Yeah. That that's that's super whack. Hold on, we trying to. Yeah. Somebody snitched the, like a. I said the audio. Damn, hold on. I don't even know why. My audio or your, yours? They saying you a little low, but it's something I'm not doing on my uh, end. What about now? Do I sound better now or no? They said it's, it's ticking. Yeah, that's, ticking? I heard that ticking when you first start calling me. Off of this, John John, you notice I ain't saying too much of nothing. The fuck? Yeah, I don't know what the fuck. Y'all can still hear it? Man, I've been hearing it the whole time on the phone with you. I just didn't, I, you know, I just didn't expect, <laughs> you know, whatever. It's all good. I can't hear it. You said it's my yeah, mic. you probably can't, officer. We can hear it. Yo, watch your mouth. They said it's, the, they said it's <laughs> not that <laughs> bad. Is, is it bearable? They said it's okay. They said it's bearable. It's bearable. Long as it's fucking bearable. Hey, you know, y'all got it. Y'all gotta get a little better with that shit. Hey, but on some on some serious shit, only fans is where the money at, bird. Man, look, I'm I'm making video. I'm ready to put my little house. I've been dropping <laughs> poles and shit too, boy. Only so fans like, is where the money at. Man, what nigga? I'm finna make a whole motherfucking porn fest on y'all, man. Y'all see, I'm in my Jesus mode. I... <laughs> yeah, only yeah, um. Oh. We talked that we talked a lot about uh no, this nigga. No. We talked a lot about fucking um we talked a lot about uh early on as far as females in battle rap and you know uh yeah. battlers being able to get bitches, this type of shit, and then we talked about um you know the next level of shit, having your have having your girl have a girl. And I don't think a lot of Battle rappers experience yeah, that kind of go. shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't think a lot of battle rappers experience that kind of shit. What's he? What's he that? Well, you know that's that's only for a chosen few. You know what I'm saying? That ain't for everybody. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. I remember. I remember early on. I want to know if you still feel this way. You say uh, the fans usually gravitate gravitate towards more the dirty and the uncool battlers over. The, 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 the clean or the niggas that look like they got it together already. Do you still feel like it's that right now or yeah. is it more so back then? <laughs> still like that? Yeah. The fuck? Like, come on. Like, just, just think about it. You know it's still like that, man. But it's okay because, like, you got to understand. It's more like now. See, this is why I want to explain to y'all, like, how where battle rap has become. It used to be about being cool. It used to be about fitting in and and standing out at the same time but it's like nah it's not no more battle rap now is for the rejected person mm. it's just what it is like if like like if you wasn't ever cool in the real world learn to rap take a few battles lie on stage a few times lie on stage <laughs> make, it make that shit sound good and then you go to your bucket yeah but there, there's been a- back in the day it was more about like Back in the day, it was more about you had to, we had to really find out who the fuck this nigga was. Yeah. Now? Nah. 
Yeah. Anybody, they could come out of Best Buy and shit and turn Tupac like a motherfucker. It shit don't matter. It don't matter. <laughs> why? Why you think it's like that though? Um, like I said, I think it's more for the. It's 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 just hard to explain that shit. Like I I don't know. People just gravitate more to the lower person. It's like okay, think about this. Every time we see Floyd fight, we know Floyd not gonna lose. We just mm. it's just exciting to see if somebody can hit the nigga or something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it'll be people. It'll be people dumb, just just angry enough with themselves that they are bet against Floyd, knowing that he's not gonna lose. And that's you know the type of saying? shit I hate. I always hate it when niggas go against the winners. That's 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 weird. And then, then if you ride with the winners, you a bandwagon. So you with, yeah. like so you forcing a nigga to go with the losers? Like I, I don't get that. I never got that. Like I always been a Floyd fan, a LeBron fan, anybody that's fucking winning, those them niggas. I never had a problem giving flowers or giving credit. And it's not it's not a Floyd fight I'ma watch and just say, I want him to lose, knowing damn well he's not gonna lose. Well, now, you know, you can, I can't even really complain about it because this is a new world. You know what I'm saying? Now it's about whoever the fan like, period. They don't have to be good. Yeah. Like, that's it. It ain't, ain't got to be good. You just got to be liked. That's it. Like, and, and like for what, what reasons, like, though? So it's about to come on before the rap. So, so a nigga can just you be. What? I said, like for what reasons, though? Because if if you watching a sport like like basketball. And if you like somebody that's playing, you you like their skills, so you kind of gotta they kind of gotta be good for you to like them. Like what? How how it gets so weird to the point where niggas will find reasons to like somebody other than skills. That makes sense. That's just a new new way. It's just a new way. It's like okay, like a verb fan is like different from a chess fan or a chess fan from a verb fan because we represent two different things. So if you if you more or see is you're a rival chess. If you more like with verbiage, you're right with verbiage. So it's not really about skill no more. This shit is more wrestling now than ever. It's yeah. more wrestling. More anything. It just it's just what the fan likes. And it's been like wrestling, or you think it was different in the beginning. Well, it was a lot different in the beginning. Oh, wait. It, it was wait, a lot different in the beginning. Insane, but 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 you can't complain. It's just you still in their world. You gotta play by their rules. It's just what it is. It's like, all right, all right, cool. I literally, I literally said, I literally you know, said I that. From, it wasn't that. I literally said that but, the last time I went live. That um, cause somebody asked me if there was something I could change about battle rap, what would I change? And I said politics. But that's mm -hmm. not for me to complain about politics now because it's here now. So you gotta know how to play them now. You know what I'm saying? You, I could not like something. But the fact remains, politics plays a part, so you, you, you got to play it, so you can't complain. So shit changes, of course, but you got to change with the times and know how to play that game because you're not just going, one man can't just take the politics out of battle rap. Can't happen. All right, so let me, let me ask you this. But what battle rapper don't feel like he the best one? How are you going to tell him he ain't the best one? I mean, yeah, I mean, every battle rapper should feel that way. But uh, you can tell certain people why they're not the best if you're comparing um, what niggas done. But, but, but look, in, in battle rap, there's no way to, to determine who's the best. It's all opinion. Oh, no, nah, it's not. It's not. What's the best? Nah. Yeah. But you could, you could tell opinion, who's amongst the best. You could tell who's amongst the best. You can't pick one. When you say. And say they the best. I mean, yeah, but if you say. If you say. People that's amongst the best, you 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 still gonna name twenty five guys. Yeah, yeah. Like easy, amongst the best, you gonna still name twenty five people. So how can you tell none of them niggas they ain't better than the the next one? Nah, you can't. I mean, that's twenty five out of thousands. Problem. Everybody got a pro. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody got a matchup problem, a style problem that bothers them and shit. So, mm -hmm. you know, that's a fact. I can't. I can't. I can't even, it's no way to, yeah, everybody do. Who's your matchup problem? It could be somebody you battled already or somebody you didn't battle. Uh, like for your style, it would be a matchup problem for you. Uh, Other than me. Depends on the setting too. Mm. 
<laughs> you heard that late? Nah, yeah, nah, the setting for yeah. sure. For the, the setting for sure. Yeah, the, the setting. Uh, yeah. I mean, like, uh, uh, my roughest matchups, uh, it's a lot of different things that go into that. Number one is where we at. Mm -hmm. That's number one first. Like, where are we? Mm -hmm. Where are we in the first place? All right, cool. The second style, okay, I can tell you the styles I don't like matching up with. I don't, I don't like corny niggas, like jokesters. Yeah. I hate them. I hate jokesters. And, um, uh, niggas that's whack that the world love. I hate them. And, 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 and you know what? I don't like punchliners either. Mm. Like, rapid punchliners, I don't like them niggas. Like an aff? It's a different. Like drunk aff? Well, see, well, 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 <laughs> well, see, it's a different, it's a different type of punching though like it, it, okay now the good thing about punchliners is by the time you were a round and a half of them all that shit sound the same yeah that's yeah. not a good thing yeah. yeah like it's like one two shot shot after a while the human brain in the ears is going to go numb regardless it's just a part of the human body hmm. so that's the only good thing about them but when they own them bitches own though you know what i'm saying yeah yeah they own Nah, that, that's true too though with the with the punchlines. By the time they get to the third, the only way I feel like the third to turn up is if they choke in the second or something, and then they gotta come back with a comeback, and then now the people are excited again. But for three rounds straight, the straight punchline no. niggas. No, 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 no. There is there, there is no punchline that can keep you entertained all three rounds. Not like that. No. Unless they battling another punchline nigga. No, nah, I still a whole bunch of that shit. The ears still gonna go numb. Yeah. It, it, the numb, the ears are gonna go numb because the style. Now, now you're forcing me to listen too hard. Like, mm. okay, like punchliners are like, or like boxers that just throw very hard shots over and over and over again. Yeah. After a while, the body gonna get numb to that hard shot. Yeah. Now the niggas that throw the jab and then, then the straight, straight right hand. Now, boom. different yeah that already yeah i i never i never felt like punchline niggas was a problem for me it was a point in time where i was i was trying to do a lot of punchlines but to battle a punchline nigga i always felt like they one trick ponies so i could easily just dance around them and they're going to be doing the same thing the whole time. And if I show a range, and, and it worked. It worked for me a few times, quite a few yeah. times. But you ain't, um, I don't think you ever had no problem. Yeah, what punchline is in? Who, you, um, which punchline do you battle? You never battled a, a punchline. Nah, line. I think Charlie was the first one. Charlie. And that was the first punchline. Um, uh, Danny. Mm, Danny's definitely uh, a punchliner. Danny, Big K. Big K, punchliner. Yeah, Danny, Big K. Um, that's pretty, like, like I really try to stay away from them niggas for real, though. But I don't, <laughs> yeah, I just stay away from them. And you, yeah. You'd rather battle niggas like, uh, yeah. niggas that's going to talk about something, the Luxes, the Calicos, and shit like that? I think it, I think... I like them all. I like different styles of them. It's just the punchline. It's the one, two, three, four guys. Those are the ones that's like, you know what I'm saying? Because you got upper, you got upper echelon punchline as though like Rum Nitty, mm. like uh, uh, Tay Rock. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Speaking of Tay Rock, what's up with that? Shit, ask you real. What's up with it? Yeah, what, 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 I'm around. I'm around. Shit, what's up? What the? What they avoided, man? I, what, what? Like, what's the issue? I know Rock ready. I know Rock want that. I don't know what the issue is. I mean, we've been ready. We've been ready to play ball for a while. I mean, y'all might want to add them on Twitter. Say, hey, what's the? What we doing? You know what I'm saying? Saying so y'all can talk to them. <laughs> but shit, you know, I'm around. You know. So I think Definitely I, around. I think I kind of know the answer to this next question, but I could be wrong. Um, what what, what you prefer? Okay. The setting and battling, small room like in a bubble type shit, like gnome, 
X, how they did Gnome X, or do you miss the crowds? Because I would assume the small room. You said it's all. Like, no. I like, um, the big rooms are crazy because I done destroyed a lot of big rooms. The energy in there is a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Crazy. Only, I've only been had, pro I've only had problems in big rooms three times in, in New York City. That was it. Other than that, like, no, nah, the big room shake is, is a feel. Mm. Now, that only thing is they don't, they don't catch a lot of what you say in the big room, but mm. it's a feel. The small room is dope too, though, because it's like you don't really got a lot of pressure on you. It's like yeah. you're performing your art. You ain't got to worry about nobody jump, you know, ruining it or nothing. So that's a great thing too. So it's really, if somebody asks you, like, what would you rather battle in? You want some flip a coin shit. Don't even matter. Either one. <clears throat> you ain't even th think about choosing. Uh, big room, I, I, bigger room, I give, bigger room, I get more money. So, yeah, the big one. Probably. That is a fact. <laughs> That is a fact. Tickets is being sold. That's a whole different situation. All right, so let's let's. That's a big difference. Yeah. So you mentioned it the three times. Um, you had a hard time in New York. I want to talk about that. The Aver versus New York crowds. I had a different view. We spoke about this a few right. times, but uh, I still got a different view on that. So I'm gonna let you. Uh, shoot yeah. back at me after I say what I gotta say. Um, you started that shit, Bert. You started that shit after the after the clips battle. Um, you was basically on some fuck you, before. New York niggas. It's before. Before, before, before. Yeah, long before I was on it off the jump. So why yeah, though? I, I still am. But yeah. why though? Why I'm before that? I'm saying, hey, listen. I, okay, let me tell you. I didn't come into this shit uh, to be friends with nobody. Man, maybe I played rough in the beginning. I thought, hey, this how we play it. If y'all don't play rough, I, oh, my bad. I, okay, let me put some pads on it. But for me, <laughs> hey, shit, I'm on it. What's up? I'm a St. Louis nigga. That's what, that's what I stood for. That's what I still stand for. I'm still on it. Nah, I, I, listen. Like, come on, that's what that was the best time of battle rap, though. It definitely was. It definitely was. It definitely was. But what I'm saying is, you was on yeah. fuck New you York. Had, you, had you didn't say fuck everybody. You said fuck New York crowds. Fuck New York. Fuck you, you New York niggas. It, I feel like your target was New York, not everybody. You ain't say fuck Detroit. Of course, that was Midwest movement, Chicago. Of course, all of that. But I feel like you targeted New York and then... When New York, and you were still, and you a funny nigga too, because you was still, <laughs> you was not turning down no battles in New York. You was not turning down no battles in New York. Anytime I seen you in New York, you was maybe one deep, and it would probably be a female. And if you was more than one deep, yeah. it was two females. Yeah. After every every time you 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 talk that shit, what is it about New York that you don't like? Don't say you was you was on like that with everybody. It's New York. You targeted New York. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. I said what I said. <laughs> but why though? That's what I'm saying though. Why New York? I mean, I, mean, I didn't target uh, uh, Des Moines, Iowa. No, I target <laughs> a big city, right? I didn't target a small city. I targeted a big city. Right? I let y'all know what I. Listen, I let y'all know when I came in the game. I'm not here for that. I ain't here to be nobody partner. I'm here to prove that I'm, I'm, I'm that we can play the game. Mm. I play. I don't give a but fuck, I don't bend, and I don't fold. I said what I said. What's up? Yeah, I proved y'all whatever I need to prove y'all too, right? What's up? At the end of the day, I came and did what I said I was gonna do. Yeah, the fuck. That's yeah, a fact. I'm still who I am. That's like, a fact. When you get on that court, I, I, I'm, I'm not here to be all the. I'm not here to be friends with niggas. I come in and do my job, and I get it going, and mm. I represent for my where I'm at. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because we ain't had no voice like that. We ain't had no voice, so I'm the voice. Yeah, I said it. What's up? Mm. Yeah. And that's how I bang. And guess what? I came here and I did exactly what the fuck I said I was going to do. Yeah. What's up? And that's why you the island guy. Yeah. That's why I sit where I sit by myself. And nothing can bother me. Mm. Ever. Because there was because no like handouts. Yeah, no, no. I put, y'all don't see, most of y'all don't even know what it's like to walk in a place like New York City and no one ain't finna say fuck you. You still stick your chest out like, nigga, fuck you, take it from me. Mm. Yeah. Every mm. time. And that's what was up with. But it, what it did is, 
it earned a respect from New Yorkers as well. Like, hey, dude, don't give a fuck. He the same nigga wherever he at. At home, it don't matter. I'm the same nigga I am. I am who I am. That's What's a up? fact. I represent. I represent for St. Louis. I don't represent for New York City. I represent for St. Louis, and I mean that because we ain't had no voice. Mm. So, 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 my people. So, so, when you come to St. Louis with me, you see the difference. Mm-hmm. Like when somebody runs to me in St. Louis, you can ask them, I don't gotta do this. It's mm. a difference. It's, it's a feel. Because mm. it's like, hey, that's dude. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's it. And so I, I let my people out, mm. lead them out. You know what I'm saying? So now, like you gotta think, 10 years ago, people felt like, okay, St. Louis is a joke mm. with raps. They don't joke now. They don't laugh now. What's up? Definitely they not. They don't laugh now. Definitely like, is not. It a, is it a joke? Nah, it ain't no joke. No, it ain't. And guess what? Wherever I'm at, it's a certain respect that I demand. It's a certain respect that's given to me because because I walk my road and I ain't be friends with nobody. I ain't hold hands with nobody. But I came in with who I came in with, and that was that. Mm. I ain't come in this motherfucker and try to click up with no with, with no navy blue hats. I wear the real. That's all I did. <laughs> and I stood on my own ground and I proved what I came to prove. Mm. Yeah, that's how I get out. It wasn't no going in the house. I never fold. Mm. I ain't quit. I took whatever came with it. Mm. And I became one of the biggest faces of this fucking game. And I'm a St. Louis nigga. I ain't even supposed to be here. Let me talk my shit, though. Talk your shit, nigga. Here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, wasn't even, I, wasn't, I, I wasn't even designed to be playing as one of the greatest people in the world at battle rap. Y'all don't got to like me, but you got to respect it because mm. it's documented. Mm. You got to respect it. You ain't got to like me. Mm. I, ain't, I don't give a fuck if you don't like me. I ain't here to be nobody's pot anyway. I can't fist pump you niggas through the screen. Mm. I said what I said. Yeah. I represent for these people and people like me. Mm. Yeah. And, and, and I came and I did what I said I was going to do. And at mm. the end of the day, guess what? All heads shall bow and every knee shall... I'm going to create something fly for that. Some Jesus-like shit. Long as when I come in the room, y'all niggas know what's up with them. Hey, that's dude. Yeah. Are you that's been, dude. How are you, you doing? Are you been yeah. saying this same you, shit for yeah. years. I know that for a fact. You've been saying this same Ain't shit I've been four different- for years. Hey, hey look. Hey, look, look. Hey, hey, look. I don't even gotta say it no more. And ain't shit changed, nigga. I came. I just been. I've been four different niggas in ten years. <laughs> I kept bending. I kept changing to different people and shit. I, ain't shit changed. Look, let me tell you something. Mm-hmm. When it was that clip up and and Holmes, he said that, hey, you can't compare me to Verb because I'm better than Verb. You see how them people talking? Yo, I ain't gotta say nothing to him. Yeah, the- I ain't gotta say nothing to him. You lying. Don't, don't talk to God like that. God knows he's telling the <laughs> truth or not. Don't talk, talk to God talk like to that. Him, Oh, nah, we gonna just ignore it, you know what I'm saying? Cause guess what? I, Cause guess what? I know what you really thinking. I'm God. I'm all powerful. Yeah. I know what you really thinking, man. You can't fool me. You can fool the humans with it, baby. You can't fool me with that. I yeah. created you. What you mean? I open. I, I created you. I open the lane opportunity for you, big dog. Yeah. These these, so these new where, niggas. Where are you from? These ask new. Him, ask him where you from? Where 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 are you from? Who Holmesy? Holmesy? Yeah. Holmesy from, from Jersey. Yeah. <laughs> I you from Jersey. All right, cool. There it is. So, so you know, your role was a little different, big dog. You on the East Coast? I opened the door for a whole reason. You got to get in. It's gonna take a, it's gonna take some time to to be compared mm. to the God, baby. I ain't gonna even do you like that. Cause let me tell you something. A lot of people that came into the game, they was like ten when mm. we was running shit. They these niggas twenty five or something now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Twelve, twenty two. Like so, it's a different thing. Now I've been through every era of my time. Okay. Yeah. Mm. So, so, so you got to do your. You got to get your, you know, you got to, you know, get some pocket change before you make that octave change, big dog. That ain't that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Take your time. Let it, you know, you get that. You get that, big dog. Nah, right yeah, there. you know, you, the, you know, these new niggas is say these new niggas. Yeah. They be they. I I don't like. I don't even get mad at the new niggas for the shit that they talk no more. I get mad at the people around them for letting them say certain shit or the fans hyping I mean, certain how, shit. How how though, John John? You can't do that. Nah, because the same way you say, the same way you say, you eat crazy food, you gonna say crazy shit. But the same way you say, when a nigga say something, cause I don't, I don't see interviews when niggas spoke bad about me and you know how the tide changed now. You look at the comments, they'll fry anybody talking crazy about me right now. Same way you say, Holmes, he says something about you and they frying that nigga because, but people, it's still people that would, that would say, yo, we want to see it. We want to see it, cause that's how me and Jack Boy happened, and I didn't, I didn't, I didn't like. I really got annoyed with the fact that y'all really doing this. This nigga ain't do nothing compared to what I was doing, and then they go back and compare, you know, when I was about to battle Hitman, 
And even back then, right? When I used to talk shit to y'all niggas and y'all talk shit to me, I never argued with y'all when y'all said anything factual. Can you agree with that? I never, when you said, look, when y'all was telling me, yo, John, John, you got to do X, Y, oh, Z, never, this, never. this, this, and that. Never. I said, oh, yeah, y'all got it. Never. Just know when never. I run into y'all, it's going to yeah. be a problem. That's all, that's my, yeah. that's been yeah. my yeah. argument. Actually, actually. Actually, that was your whole everything. It was just like, I'm going to get there. Yeah. Okay, cool. We don't mind if y'all say I'm going to get there, but you can't say you there not right now, big dog. You Come can't on. even compare that shit. It's not the same. Because all, all we're going to do is get in front of you and show you what we know that you don't know. It ain't going to go there if you play with the real ones. Exactly. Now, you can ones that don't take it seriously. I mean, play with the real ones. You are real. URL wouldn't even book most of y'all versus me. It's nothing like that. It's going to cost them too much money. And then they know the outcome of it. They give me the free money because, yeah, it's not because of skill. It's the fact that y'all just don't know. Just don't know. Y'all don't know what we Well, that's it. The experience. They think yeah, They think it. by disrespecting niggas that <laughs> literally paved the way is the way to go. Like, nah, nigga, I didn't disrespect Hitman. I wasn't disrespecting you. I didn't disrespect... Bi it wasn't disrespect, nigga. It was more so... Y'all talking to me because y'all had a certain status, yeah. but we talk about skill-wise. If I battle y'all niggas, I'm gonna show y'all niggas what's up. That was my whole point, and that's why it was never... Nothing was ever took outside of battle rap. It was never no nothing, and we stayed in touch from there till now, and niggas really... You know what I mean? So I think that's the difference that these I new mean, niggas look, is missing. Kobe did, Kobe did it to Kyrie. Don't forget, Kobe, boy, well, you know what you're saying? You saying you can beat me, you know what you're saying? Yeah. Like, you know, yeah, you got, that's just, that's just hazing. That's okay. Yeah, exactly. You gotta put your work in, but, but when you come in and you feel like, okay, look, I'm this, I'm better than them. How? How you better than niggas that been here 10 and you ain't been here five, bro? How? How you better than us? You, like, okay, what's your biggest battle? Mm. You ain't put down on us? You ain't, like, because it's different levels of, of, of 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 top names, bro. Mm -hmm. It's different levels of top names. Some you, you you know some top names ain't gonna play no games with you, and some will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some will. I'm not one of the ones that's gonna play with you, punk man. Like, but but they not gonna. I told them. I said, hey, uh, I take one of them rookies. You think they call me back? Fuck no, they ain't gonna give me no free money. So <laughs> fuck. They want me to work for money. They not. Man. They not doing that. They not doing that. That's why I ain't do yeah, no rookies versus veg battle. Like, nah, we not. Man, they like, nah, we're not paying for that shit. Because, nah, because they want to show. It ain't going to be no show against the pros like that, bro. Not active pros. No, you, no you're not getting that off. But 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 it's okay to feel like you're great. Just get up under a nigga and, and say, let me learn from him. Soak mm -hmm. the game up and then go on your own mission. Y'all just come in sticking y'all chest out like y'all. Teaming up with niggas in, 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 <laughs> in your same lane. You, they, niggas that. come in teaming up with niggas that's in the same boat they in. It's hard to learn from anybody that okay. way. I, I I don't get that shit. I mean, what 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 poor nigga want to click up with more poor niggas? That don't even make sense. That's like where, 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 your, where your inspiration coming from? Like 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 where like you know what I'm saying? Like hey hey, hey look, we all fucked up. Let's be friends now. What the? Fuck? Yeah, that ain't that ain't that ain't it. I need to talk to y'all for. That ain't I'm it. Talk to you, nigga. That's fuck, not... I'm gonna sit around. We all fucked up. What I'm gonna sit with y'all niggas for? Nah, let me sit around some niggas doing better. Yeah. Like that's some that's some but that's some stupid type of low level thinking type shit. Yeah. Like it, it it ain't just look like this. It ain't no rapper that get a record deal that come out and he wanna hang with the niggas that just walk through the door. No, he don't. Man, he wanna yeah. hang with Drake now, man. He's right. Crazy. And if he hanging out with some nigga that just walked through the door, that's cause they under him. They, 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 Cause they or, or, or they connected on the yeah, same yeah. level, same lawyer or some shit. Yeah, other yeah, than yeah. that, nah, man, like that, man. Y'all gotta smarten up. Get next to somebody and say, hey, look, man, I'm, I, I want to be great like dude. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I want to. How, how can I learn from you, big bro? Mm -hmm. Play the fake big bro shit. You know? <laughs> the fake, because that's we, super we, fake. We really want y'all to come up so we can get the money off y'all. Yeah. Yeah, play that shit. Man. Oh hey, look, my god, money. that's Watch a gym. Up, come up, man. We. Yeah, easy money, easy fucking money. Can't wait. Like, look, so look, so look, fellas, we on y'all team. Look, we on y'all team. We'll come yo, to the ring so we yo. can take it from you. Yeah, yo. why the fuck? Verb, why the fuck? verb, verb, verb. verb. Want, I gotta stop you there. To make it into the finals. I gotta stop you there, verb, because I swear to my son, this the same conversation I had with Jack Boy. I said, nigga, you think I don't want to do the battle? <laughs> you think I don't want to? You just gotta get to the point where they willing to pay me oh. what I want for you. That's the only thing that's in the way here. That's the only thing that's in the man, way here. Man, listen. Man, 
that. That's the most beautiful thing about this shit. Because it's like once y'all get up, y'all still don't even know what we know. We go in, take the money, and then everybody happy. You get you a big name, I get a bigger bag. We Come keep... on, man. Come on, man. Move it. Like, I'm I'm but, so but, I'm but so we happy you said that. We don't want to keep y'all isolated. We want you niggas to come up, man. Like come on, so 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 just fake big bro on us. Just get under a nigga, man. He, we want to see you get up. You gotta think, cause look, if I train up two niggas, John John train up two niggas, man. We both just made two different checks. Say the wrong thing to them. It's up. It's up. They just two. They, they, come on, man. Work together. It's up. Yeah, stop being dumb. <laughs> like put your ego to the side, man. Because guess what? When you get off stage, you can't go home. Nobody your bitch, nothing. I know you can't. Don't do that. It make more sense to sit up on us and say, hey, look, hey, man, how can I expand myself? Mm-hmm. Should I want to come home and be able to take her out to eat twice this week or something? All right? You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Nigga, you got to make here. it back here. home with some of that you money. You'll be buying Michael Kors. They can spend yeah, all that man, money right where they got it at. Yeah, they can spend all that money right where they got it at. And ball caps, man. If y'all don't shut the fuck up. Yeah, so, so 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 that's why yeah that's why you you you're not better than us because the budget different. Yeah. The the, the rooms are different. Mm-hmm. That's why you're not better than us. So don't say that stupid shit. Say I need to fuck with them niggas so I can be like that. Mm-hmm. So I won't be getting booked in motels and I can I can stay in fly five star shit mm-hmm. where people bring you food and shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm just talking the real shit. You ain't gotta like it, but you gotta respect that for mm-hmm. a fact. You gotta mm-hmm. learn from it though. Like, come on, man, just think about it. When your when your girl wish you off on the plane and you a rookie, you coming to URL. Come on, what's coming back? Nothing. You get your head cracked like you gonna get your head cracked. Then what? You can't even take her nowhere. So relax. Cause this ain't about skill. That's what's wrong with y'all. It ain't about skill. It's about the whole package. It ain't got nothing to do with skill. Mm. Nothing. So stop stop coming this motherfucker thinking it's about oh I rap better than him. So right. The fuck. What else? What the fuck does that mean? Yeah. It's a, Oh, uh, what the fuck does that mean? Nothing? Yeah, so, okay, cool. So, you got to figure out, hey, how do I make myself a brand to where they want to pay me? Because mm-hmm. when you, I'm going to tell you right now, when you get that first, when you get that first five-figure check, the first one, it's going to it's gonna really feel good. Trust me. When you start saying, hey, look, I just, I just made 10000 Yeah, I'm a five-figure you know? nigga. Like, when you, yeah, yeah, like, when you, yeah, like, when you doing that, mm-hmm. it's a whole different thing. It, it, it's even crazy when you get to them five figures and they start saying 20 and 30 and 35. And boy, shit, like, that's a different thing. Way different. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So guess what? You're losing. Don't feel that bad that way, baby. Mm-mm. It feel bad if you, it, it feel bad if they book you for 1200 Yeah. It feel bad. Yeah, you lose for twelve hundred, losing for twelve hundred, and losing for twenty k is two different losses. Yeah, it's two different losses. Even if you lose for twenty k, <laughs> your next hey, battle, it's, hey, it's still gonna be at least fifteen. Still gonna get twenty, man. Th- yeah. yeah. Hey, listen. So guess what? Mm-hmm. This is how you can know get paid after battles. If somebody have a bad battle. If somebody on the camera talking, they're like, man, it was great, man. He was dope. I just got to get better next time. Yeah, because he made the fucking bad. <laughs> the niggas that breathe the hardest and shit, them the ones who didn't eat. You know what I'm saying? Niggas can't <laughs> focus at interviews and shit, looking around. They can't, they don't even know, they, they can't even answer the, the question. And the ones that say shit like, you know what? I mean, for real, I think I really beat him the first two of them. Then them the niggas that got the 900. Mm. The niggas who getting, you know, who who who, 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 who can buy a uh, uh a challenger each time they go on stage, them type of niggas, they mm. gonna be happy. Hey, what's up with you? Everything good? Yeah, mm. I gotta get better next time. Mm. Shit like that. Let me ask you this: as far as the the new doing no rap. the new niggas today, how long you think it's gonna take them to to get that five figure mark? Like, are they way behind? Like, what are they what are they doing wrong? Because I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. Um, I think mm-hmm. as far as the niggas that came in with me. Or after me, other than maybe T Top, um, we the only ones that hit that five figure mark. From 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 my class, uh, to T Top, T to Top came after me, but everybody else from that they not they not at the five figure mark, and it's it, and um, I know why for certain reasons you got to move a certain way, um. Mm-hmm. And when when you take a lot of battles at the same fucking price, <laughs> back to back, it's hard to grow your shit because you being too accessible and you people seeing you more. Yeah, you get stuck yeah. at that shit. So even when your price go up, let's say the next year, it may go up a stack. But that's coming from fifteen hundred to a stack. So then next year, you know what I mean? And then it get to a point where where niggas might be at the five, 
or the six, and they don't go up from there. They, they, they'll they just book you multiple times and let that shit add up like that. Yeah, but see, look, but, but see, but, but see, guess what, though? The reason is because y'all don't come in and get up under no kings. Y'all come in as nothing. Y'all don't got no endorsement. Y'all don't got nobody putting their arm around you or protecting you. Nah, so they, y'all niggas are fish. Hey, look, yeah, I, I need six battles from you, man. I'll give you five thousand. Yeah. Shit like that, man. Like, come on, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. That's it. That's learn, not... learn, learn. You know, come in cause, because because we don't want y'all spots, bro. Trust me. We we don't want that. Like, we just don't. Okay? Y'all want what we want. Yeah. So if you want what we want, you have to come where we are, mm -hmm. idiots. Do what yeah. we do. And then, and then yeah, they don't want to... Yeah, they, they don't want to hear the real shit. This is the real shit. Like, bro, mm -hmm. we don't want y'all spots. Mm -hmm. We don't care. Nothing about, like, it's some, it's some rookies... That I couldn't even identify if you paid me to. Like, I, I, what's his name? I heard his name, but I don't know what he looked like. Shit like right. that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Never heard a bar or nothing, but you heard a couple yeah. people mention him or something. Yeah, you, but I, I couldn't pick him out in the room, no. You think the the lack of YouTube yeah. releases is hurting their brand, too? The lack of YouTube? It hurts everybody's brand. Yeah. It hurts everybody. Because, um, uh, if you have a great going, a lot of people don't want to just go be buying or want to make it accessible. So mm -hmm. it's actually good too because if you get your ass smoked, who gonna see it anyway? Yeah, yeah, see so it. it's a, you know it's a good thing. So it's like the rap. See what the era we come from. If you lost it, it you you like it, the era we come from. A loss stung you for three four months every day. <laughs> they would not let that shit go. Never. Now, shit. There's now, so I many battles, niggas will forget. Yeah, niggas will forget. Yeah. <laughs> niggas will forget. Yeah. Niggas yeah. will forget. Yeah, it's like it's like whatever happens Saturday. It's like okay, like guess what? You ain't even seeing it. Hey, nobody's talking about Lux and Surf no more, and ain't talking about Mook and Rock no more. Mm. Shit over it. You just lasted you know right then now, and there. Would have been ten years ago. Let it would have been ten years ago. That shit would still be going. St on. That shit would be going on for ten oh, years. <laughs> they don't let shit go. Yeah, nah, yeah, I, I feel the same Honestly, way though. Hey, but. I got people. I, I, yeah, yeah, nah, but this is a different time though. You know what I'm saying? Mm. You know, so it is what it is. You you like the way uh, like how shit is happening now compared to back then? Like, is it is it is it easier for for to come up in battle uh, rap now or harder to? Like, which one is harder back then or now to come up? In well, well, back then way harder because it was more talented guys with, with unique styles now everybody's the same so you face the same person the gang of times it don't matter mm. and, and back then so you had to really be just, chosen it it's, it's, back, it's way harder but right like back then you had yeah, to be yeah, you had to be then, chosen yeah, you can't you can't just know somebody really, like, they they sought after you who's making yeah. noise over here Who's doing this over there? Yeah. Well, get that nigga over yeah. here. So when you got all of y'all together, like the beginning URL days, this was like the best of the best. This is like, this is it. Now, like, these days, you, you can understand. know somebody and get in. Look, look at the our, our first wave. Mm -hmm. You had Verb, Hitman, Ice Pack, Remy. Mm -hmm. You had Big T. You had X Factor. You mm -hmm. had My House. You mm -hmm. had Mav, Cortez, Hollow, Goods, mm -hmm. Conceited, mm -hmm. uh, Arse. Mm -hmm. uh, it, like, th these are different styles of MC. This ain't the same person over and over and over again. Marv One, Quest McCoy, you mm -hmm. had a lot of people that was outside, bro. That's not like nothing to, like that was dangerous. Different, you, nobody sounded the same. So it's like, I don't know what I'm walking into. And that was now, the hungry time. Everybody is a, 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 a yeah, uh, well, well actually, who started the cloning was Charlie Clips. When after people saw him beat me, that became the style because I didn't lose before that. I was too dangerous or windstorm. Mm. So mm. then everybody started doing the Charlie style. Then the next inf influential person was Chilla Jones. They started moving like Chilla, all this scheme, 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 scheme. Mm -hmm. scheme. all that shit. That wasn't around. That was yeah. some Chilla shit. All right, okay, cool. It became dope. Then the next one is Twerk. Everybody now is New Jersey Twerk. Well, well, t t so I think Tay Rock had it before. Tay Rock had it before Twerk. I think when Tay Rock started getting hot with wait, the wait, with the no, gun balls, saying, people wanted to rap like Rock after yeah, a while. Yeah, Tay Rock, Rock got hot later. Yeah. But 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 the thing is, when I don't I don't see similarities in Tay Rock and, and Twerk. I don't at all. 
I, I, I don't, uh, the way twerk formats is more, everybody wants that style now. No, no, I don't, I don't, yeah, yeah, yeah. Twerk nah, twerk don't sound like rock. What I'm saying is once Tay Rock got hot, more people gravitated towards that kind of style. Like, it was more niggas trying to come with rapid gun bars. The same way you said when Clips, after the battle with you, people was trying to rap like Clips. Uh, Chilla came in with the schemes. Everybody was including schemes in their shit. When Tay Rock got hot, everybody was gun bars galore. Back to well, back. Well, 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 one thing about when Tay Rock got hot, his story is so crazy because it's like he was in the NBA, but... He wasn't a star, and yeah. then he just broke out of nowhere. Kind of like, you know what? It's kind of like a Steph Curry kind of thing. Yeah. Like Steph Curry wasn't Steph Curry the first couple of years of his career. Right, he, right. He grew into that, and now he that. So that's what Tay Rock was. But he was always around, though. Like always. Yeah, Tay Rock got one of the craziest stories yeah. in battle rap. He got. Yeah. I think Tay Rock's story is crazy. I think your story is crazy. Um, yeah. my story is crazy. Um, even DNA story is crazy. Uh, there's a lot of crazy stories in battle rap, but yeah, when Twerk got hot, he influenced <laughs> the everybody. So yeah, everybody. Yeah, yeah, that that yeah, that that was too. wild. Um, Surf had an influence too. It was a lot of niggas trying to rhyme like Surf at one point too. Yeah, a lot yeah, of niggas you know, trying to a, rap like this. A, this a, like whatever style works, some, they just gonna clone. It's just like the music industry and shit. It's just wait, what time is it, John John too? It is uh, 6.47, 5.47 your way. All right, there we go. Yeah, no, I, I think, um, what was you saying about it? Uh, the, the influence, the styles. Oh, yeah, the influence. Yeah, the style. The styles really came. Those are, the, I think, our three most influential people. You know, Lux probably had a moment where he was, where people wanted to rhyme like him. But, but everybody so can't. So that's the thing. It's certain it's people niggas might want to rhyme like, but you can't. Can't, yeah, like you, you can get certain elements of it. Yeah, but you yeah. Can't get like, yeah, you can't get like the whole. Whole. You can't. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, cause they, I mean, it's. it's they compare yeah, B like, dot like, to like Lux, but that's B dot. That's how he raps. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, I don't look at B dot right, like yeah. he's trying to rap like Lux. I just feel like he just raps similar to that nigga. Yeah. I could be wrong though. Yeah, but that's how I feel. I mean, but, but, you know, in, in every game, they always compare somebody to somebody. Like, when mm -hmm. Moon sound like Fab and Mace mm -hmm. and Shine was big and shit. So, you know, it's, it's Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's just different. That's a fact. So, uh, back then, to, in the Midwest movement. But, to, but, but, let me ask you this. On the, as far as, um, you said, what about the Midwest music? What'd you say? I was about to say, uh. I was about to go into some other shit. What you was about to say, though? Nah, nah. Your phone was kind of doing something. Oh, nah. I was saying, all right, so when the Midwest movement happened, um, like, after there was a narrative that uh, you went against the Midwest movement. I, of course, I know that, that that narrative only came about because you battled X Factor and Hitman and those was angles taken on you. Um, but the way they, the way they took them angles, uh, I want to know from your point of view, like, do you think that's turning on the Midwest or was you just solely on some, uh, straight competition shit? Cause y'all was sticking together and then I, I could be wrong, but at that time it was only you from the Midwest battling other Midwest niggas. I don't give a fuck. I'm trying to get the money. I don't give a fuck. What the fuck is wrong with you niggas? Like, this ain't... I ain't pulling pistols on these niggas. Oh, you know what I'm doing? Oh, <laughs> oh, this nigga crazy. crazy. I'm talking to me like that. Like, what you mean? Like, all right, okay, so look. So let me ask you this. Uh -huh. The first Midwest nigga I took was who? Marv 1. Right? It was Miles. Well, okay, Marv 1. Okay, yeah. Marv 1 was first. Marv yeah, Marv 1, yep. I didn't know motherfucking Marv 1. Right. Fuck? Look at yeah. Okay, the next one. I but this is—I'm talking after the Midwest movement was there though, because it was Midwest against everybody else. Okay, so who did I take after that? Okay, look, look. Here go the thing. I'm a competitor at all times, bro. Mm -hmm. You can't come around me and tell me no shit like you'll kill me. I, I, I what you say? Are you going to prove it? You going to stand on it? Mm -hmm. Like I, I like no. Nah, I just maybe I played too rough. Maybe I, nah. But it, when you're trying to compete. 
Mm. No, it's okay. I'm gonna show y'all where I'm at with. I took every opportunity as, a, as an opportunity to be able to showcase what I can do. Yeah. So I didn't care about oh I eat from here and now fuck it. What's up? Flip the coin. And then there's always says okay cool. Who was better that night? Like right. come on when you go in the gym, some people want to guard the best people in the gym and some stay away from. But I'm a nigga that's gonna say I, I got do, bro. Right. So wrong, but it wasn't like you you went out your way to set these up. They called you. It was like what you think about X Factor type shit. And the answer is yes. Yeah, yeah. Before I hang up, it's a bad. But it was a Send different it. situation with you and Holla though. I think uh um I feel like you and Holla Verb, you there? I said, I feel like you and Holla yeah, yeah. at that time um, had to happen, needed to happen, uh, because y'all was the two most, the face, like St. Louis was the battle state at that time, like as far as how serious y'all took it, shit like that. Yeah. Here comes Holla, and you was, like before Holla started coming up, as far as the battle and the rap shit go, you was already top dog, correct? Well, no, he was too, though. He, See, that's the thing. Okay. He, he was the same. He just younger. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah same. So, so when I had to be on the radio on Mondays, mm -hmm. he was on the radio on Mondays. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? It, 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 he always was the the hottest nigga for his demographic. I was the hottest nigga for my demographic. Mm. You see what I'm saying? So I was always so being that, compared you know to each saying? other, regardless. Yeah. Nah, not really. It's just two different eras, and we did the same shit. Mm -hmm. But everywhere, if I gotta be there, he gonna be there. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So you, yeah, his skill was, he was already solidified. At, at, at 14, Holler was one of the hottest people walking around this motherfucker. Mm. That's why his ass act like that now. <laughs> I mean, he used to be, he used to be in a number one option, just yeah. like me. Yeah. So it's like, yeah, you know, okay, cool. So when, so when it's time to battle, I, he, he a competitor, I'm a competitor. What's that mean? Yeah. All right, let's do it. That's why I feel like yeah, that was going to happen. So we brought them and we brought, and we brought the best battle of all time. And guess what? It's trying to be cloned. After we did it, everybody started doing it. Mm. Uh, surfing and Suge. And then you see Rex and... and Sean. And, and, and it's like, it's all, come on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, like, come on. At first, it was, all oh, y'all shouldn't be doing it, man. Mind y'all business. We St. Louis niggas, man. We got it. Yeah, we yeah, yeah. Y'all worry about y'all shit, man. We do shit differently out here, man. Y'all go on, stay over there and over in, in, in this side of the world. This how we this how we maneuver. Yeah. Y'all take that old... Other shit over there, man. Like, nah. Yeah, I think the day you and Holla yeah, like, battled, yeah, like, the fucking, like, the world stopped the day y'all niggas battled. The world stopped. There ain't no telling what was going to happen, because yeah. if somebody would have really died that day, I don't know where niggas' career nah, nah, would be. No, 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 no. It's, it's, the thing is, though, like, when you're dealing with two different people that straight cold, we, we both know that ain't going to happen. Like, uh, the room was split in half, one side red, one side blue. Yeah. Like, it was just, it's, I mean, yeah, it's, that's just what it is. It's, it's nothing. And we brought back a moment, and we brought back a battle nobody could clone. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, like, a lot of y'all clap for, you know, different people and shit, but, you know, that blueprint was laid in our city. That that conceited, that conceited meme when he making that face, that, yeah. that's from St. Louis. Yeah, that was the so same. So know y'all history where y'all let though. You know what I'm saying? Our world a little different. Our laws a little different. We mm. treat people with a different kind of respect because we don't have time to be playing. Like, the way other people play, we can't play like that. Mm. Like, we don't, nah, we don't play like that. We different type of people, and that's just where we at. And that's all we cater to. You, do you think it will ever be another Midwest movement? I know they tried to do the new Midwest movement, but um, I, I don't know what happened to that. I don't know what. I don't know where it went. But I heard niggas talking about it. They was including niggas from Cleveland. Um, it was some Chicago niggas. It was some Detroit Pontiac niggas. All right, so okay, so so okay, so look, if you're gonna if you're gonna recreate something, you got to do it the same way. First thing is, where's your verb? Mm-hmm. But there's not going to be another verb, though. There's not going to be another verb. You can't. Okay, no, no, no. Who's who's your general? Who's your general? Okay. Who's your guy saying let's suit up? Who's your guy saying fuck all these other niggas? Who's your guy? Mm. You don't have one, so it won't be never be done. If you're gonna recreate something, you gotta take the same steps. Mm. I was the bold when it stepped that stepped outside, like man, fuck y'all. This is what I represent. What you wanna do about it? Mm. That was my role. So mm. one of y'all, the new guys, need to stick y'all chest out and take it and take some ownership. If if one of y'all ain't willing to go out there and die for it, then guess what? It, it'll never happen again. Somebody mm. got to risk it because the story got to be recreated. When you do a remake of a story, you do it the same way. 
Mm. You don't do it different. Do it mm. the same way. Yeah. Ain't no, ain't no. Uh, do it the same way. The Temptations movie happened in order. That's a, <laughs> that's a fact. Huh? That's a fact. I said, ain't no, ain't no, yeah, ain't no the, newer the dude. Movies, they gave you the story from how they, yeah, and how it started. That's a fact. Ain't no, no newer dudes in, the in um. They gave you the story how they met. And uh, and uh, and and, huh? and in the Midwest, you don't see no um. Is there any new dudes that you see out there that you feel like could bring it back? Because for the most part, the OGs is it's who they are. Like that ain't gonna change whether niggas keep battling or stop battling. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I think, I think, I think, talent wise, talent wise, so there's a lot of talented guys, but I mean, they I need direction. Know who's gonna be a dog enough to pick his sword up and stand? Yeah, like who gonna who gonna lead the pack? Like yeah. who gonna let me see y'all? Who, who, who gonna lead y'all pack into these boys? Because because yeah. I was the only nigga saying, man, it is what it is. What we doing? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is what I read. It's either y'all on this time or y'all not. But this is where I'm at with it. So one of y'all got to be that first. Then then you got to go down the line. Like okay, where is your guy like this? You mm. gotta put them pieces right back to. Yo, you there? You went out a little bit. Hit it? What happened? I said you went out a little bit. You good now? Oh, good. Okay, cool. So, so, so years ago, before it happened, did you ever? Um, did you see yourself battling Mook? before that happened because i know it was random to us but um you know like I mean, well i saw my i saw i, I saw myself want to be great right so it, so whatever, whatever is whatever great that took, whatever roles that took let's mm. be great mm. i wanted to go and take them all me and mook is on me and mook is on footage arguing about a battle my first year in mm -hmm. so i mean you know anything can happen but i just i just wanted to be great i wouldn't uh whatever i by any means necessary i'm gonna be great how vegan life going? Yeah. Amazing. Threesomes, parties, marijuana. <laughs> that comes with being a vegan? I got hey, If well, that comes I with mean, being a vegan, it, 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 I'm it, vegan. Hey, no, no. It, it fits the storyline. Okay. How about that? Okay. Yeah, it fits the storyline. You know, the hoes don't like the niggas that eat chicken, man. You know what I'm saying? No, they, yeah, they don't like that. They, they, they want you to nut in their face and they taste... Nah, they want to taste Starburst when you nut in their face. Like, <laughs> yeah, that's what they want. Yeah, they want to be like, oh, God, what the fuck is that shit? Like, oh, that's a gusher, bitch. What you so you, you feel a lot better. Vegan <laughs> vegan gusher. verb, you feeling a lot better. Everything feel better than eating that chicken. You yeah, told me a story about the last time you ate chicken. How, like, yeah, the yeah. last time you ate chicken, what happened? You told me, now caffeine got to know. I mean, for me... I mean, I mean, well, no, last time I ate chicken was in April of, of 2016, 2015 or 16, I want to say 16, yeah, mm -hmm. that was it, couldn't move when I woke up, I thought it was some New York poisoning, but then I said, nah, I'm just going to get this shit up, and then you ain't, you ain't looked back since, it is what it is, like, you know, but don't let me just, nah, don't let me deter y'all from, from, Nah, know, nigga. Uh, nah, nah, nah. You, you gotta, gotta you gotta it. deter us. Nah, nah, nigga. You gotta. <laughs> I need to hear this kind nah, of shit because I, I need got, to get nah, away from that. Shit, man, dude. Nah, shit, man. nah. You talk about leading the pack and all of this, that. my nigga. Come on, bro. I ain't leading y'all here, man. I don't got time to debate with y'all. Go eat your Big Mac. Do what you're gonna do, man. I ain't got time, man. It's either you. Go eat your Big Mac. Go <laughs> over there, man. I ain't. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this nigga crazy. Hey, 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 look. Hey, look. Hey, look. I got to roll out, so but I got to get up. I got to do some right there. So, man, right, that's a bet. I, I, my show finna start on. Hey, look. My show finna start on caffeine pretty soon. It's going to be wild and shit. A lot of porn and wild shit going on. What, 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 what's what's your name on there? there? Averb? Is Averb on there? Nah, hey, look. Listen, so man, they can go follow your shit right now. Averb, I think is what it is, but it's going to be wild. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, follow your shit, fine. I got the, I got the check on it. I got the check on it. So, you know, hey, look, follow me, man, because my shit gonna be wild, baby. Like, you know, Craig, you about to, you about to hold this L, but this motherfucker's gonna get wild, baby. Think Please. about, you think about to get banned off caffeine, I'm man. Getting some mouth. This nigga what? crazy. Hey, I... hey, listen, as long as I make the people happy, I'll be back. I'll be 